Hello everyone, Ben Alexander here. Did you know that in 2016, Yoshimori Osumi, a Japanese researcher, won the Nobel Prize for Medicine for his studies on autophagy? Autophagy is a process inside the body, a natural process, by which the dead cells, or the cells that are near the end of their lifespan, are sent to the liver and burned as energy. Well, here's the thing. They discovered that autophagy only kicks in once you've been fasting about 20 hours. And what I mean by fasting, like just water and black coffee. So for this reason, I'm actually in the middle of a 36 hour fast where my last meal was Friday dinner. I'm gonna go just uh, black coffee and water all day. And I'm not gonna have any meal until breakfast Sunday morning and that's a pretty clean 36 hour fast and the reason for that is there's some cancer and some health issues in my genetics and I'm using that concept of autophagy to clean out some of those old junky cells so basically it's 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 very strange how it works I'm not a scientist but apparently our bodies are so smart, they're self-healing, right? And your body knows when some of your tissue is old and gross. As a matter of fact, people who lost hundreds of pounds and have the flaps of skin, if they do it via fasting, that excess skin will eventually be like reabsorbed back into the body via autophagy. So if you've never heard of autophagy, you don't know much about fasting, and your health isn't optimal, I'd highly encourage you to look into it. It's funny because one, t one term that I heard that I thought was really interesting was how uh, sugar feeds cancer. And we have this whole process in our body where we eat this processed diet, people gain weight, they have too much insulin and too much sugar, and then they get cancer and diabetes and all these other issues. And I have to tell you, if you do a little bit of that intermittent fasting, even if you just do one meal a day, let's say every day you only eat one meal around three o'clock in the afternoon, you're gonna drop weight and feel better. But I'm doing the 36 hour fast because I like the benefits of autophagy. I'm also losing weight. Uh, I'm on the path from 235 was my, my uh, gross largest size my goal is to get down to 180 so I'm well on my way and I'm going to use fasting weightlifting and walking because I'm old anyone can walk and by the way if you can't go out and walk like I don't know two or three miles you need to really seriously reconsider your health let's put it this way if you struggle to walk three miles you should start working walking two miles every day if you struggle to walk five miles, you should start walking three every day because our body is kind of designed to walk and carry stuff. Human beings have been around over 200,000, 300,000 years. And through most of our existence, we didn't ride horses. And I, I, you know, when, when was the wheel invented? 5,000 years ago? So for most of our existence, we walked. And we're kind of designed to walk and run although running certainly gets harder if you're the average American and you're overweight. Let's start with walking. Anyway, 36 hour fast is uh, a good way to kick in autophagy. I'll tell you one thing I would do if I got a cancer diagnosis, I would start heavily fa fasting as soon as possible, especially if I was overweight with a cancer diagnosis. It can't hurt. I hope, I, you know, Go down the rabbit hole and learn a little bit about autophagy and Dr. Omori and how he won the Nobel Prize. It's fascinating stuff. I hope you have a great day.